is Zertastic and today we're going to draw a cute little monkey. Find something to draw with and something to color with and let's get started. Keep your eyes open for Van Gogh's Starry Night as it's hidden somewhere in this video. All right, Artastic Nation, we're gonna start off by drawing our monkey's head and then we'll add the body and color it in. So let's get started. The first thing we're going to do is we are gonna draw the monkey's head. So we're gonna draw kind of a rounded rectangle shape here. Now you can use whatever mediums or materials you have at home. I'm gonna use black marker because it shows up really great on the film, but again, just use what you have available to you. Okay, so a rectangular shape, and then at the top, add some zigzag lines for the hair. Next, we're gonna add two monkey ears, so two letter C shapes on either side of the head. And then you can go ahead and draw the letter C in each ear, keeping in mind that one is a little bit backwards. Next, we're gonna draw an oval in the inside of the face. On either side of the face, we're gonna draw two circles. And then you're gonna color in almost the entire circle except for just one little dot for the glare of light. Next, you're gonna draw one U, two U's for the mouth. And then you got a little monkey face. Okay, so for the body, we're gonna add some zigzag lines and bring it down and curve underneath to make kind of a circular belly. And then we're gonna add some fuzz on the chest with some very, very crazy zigzag lines. Next, we're gonna do the arms. So we're gonna do some zigzag lines coming out. Bring it in. Same on the other side. And then you can draw your monkey hands. And remember, if you don't like the way that I'm drawing something, you can always add your own artist flavor to your work and draw it in your own style. Okay, we got two little arms. Now we're gonna draw the legs. And they're just two diagonal lines coming down to a point. Add some zigzag lines on the bottom. Now I like to draw toes using the letter C. So I'm gonna do three letter C's on each side. One, two, three. And notice how they kind of connect at the bottom. And then I draw the top of the foot by drawing one line in. And for the bottom, I kind of go in, down for the heel, around to touch the leg. In, down for the heel, around touch the leg. Now, if you would like, you can add some shading with some hatching lines. So you can just add hatching wherever there would be shadows. And once you're satisfied, you are ready to color. For coloring, I'm gonna do a combination of felt marker and pencil crayon, but you feel free again to use whatever mediums you have at home. So I'm gonna do the body with my felt marker and then I'll do the face anywhere there's skin with pencil crayon. Draw one squiggly line and 
another squiggly line. And a nice big rounded tip. And some zigzag lines at the tip. There we go. I'm going to color the skin areas of the monkey just with a cream or beige colored pencil crayon. And I'm also going to use the same color around the facial area and the ears and the fur on the chest.
once you're done coloring in all the beige areas or cream colored areas of your monkey, you're going to grab a white for highlights and a black for shadows. I'm going to begin with, um, I'm gonna, uh, yeah, no, we'll begin with our shadows first. And first, I'm gonna shade around the face. And just coloring right over that felt marker. I'm taking my time to blend it in, but it's gonna make it really pop. I also wanna do that under the head where the neck is and where the arms are touching the body where the belly touches the legs and the inner leg can do around the foot and any details that maybe got covered up by the pencil crown, you can just trace over like my toes there. And I'm also gonna do that around the face in just a moment. But before that, I'm gonna shade my toes where they overlap, just very gently. And you can add some shadows between the fingers. I'm gonna shade around the ear there. And then we're gonna go over the details of the face just one more time to finish it off. So first I'm gonna color nice and dark those eyes again. Again, I'm not going to color the white. I don't want to lose that detail. I'm gonna retrace over that mouth because my pencil crayon covered it up. And now I'm going to lightly, lightly, lightly shade around it to make it look extra cute. I'm also gonna shade under the mouth. And you can add some shadows or lines around the fur on the chest for some texture. And you can also add a little bit of shading around the inside of the face if you want. Okay, so that's it for my shadows and now I'm gonna do some highlights before it's done. Okay, so I'm adding some highlights along the top of the head and you can see, wow, it's popping off the page already. I don't have to press too hard. That white stands out nice on that black felt marker. I can do the other side of the legs and then along the top of the tail. And then just like that, my monkey is done. Artastic Nation, that's the end of this episode. Tune in every Tuesday evening for the premiere of the next episode and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. For more art tutorials, visit my blog at MsArtastic.com. Teachers, find my creative high quality art resources in my TPT store, Ms. Artastic. Finally, you can receive free art worksheets for kids by joining my newsletter by simply clicking the first link in my video description. All links are available in the description of this video. See you next time.